Marketing is the activity, set of institutions and processes for creating, communicating, delivering and exchanging offerings that have value for customers, clients, partners and society at large. This is a definition described by the American Marketing Association. Entrepreneurial marketing requires quantum thinking, time, knowledge, imagination and energy. Its success is measured by the company's profits and contacts. The Verges Consultant Group define entrepreneurial marketing as a unique set of marketing practices and methods used by entrepreneurs, startups and small businesses to market and build sustainable business. Another way of defining entrepreneurial marketing was by Chasson in 2016 as the behaviour exhibited by an individual and or organisation which adopts a philosophy of challenging established market conventions during the process of developing new solutions. There are a number of key attributes when it comes to entrepreneurial marketing, these including being opportunity driven, innovation focused, the ability and willingness to change, resource leveraging, risk management, customer intensity, very value driven and proactive intervention. Body Shop was founded in 1976 by David Body Shop has five core values, against animal testing, trading fairly, defending human rights, activating self-esteem and protecting our planet. Body Shop uses a number of entrepreneurial marketing within their social media platforms in order to market their campaigns. These include Facebook, YouTube, Twitter and Instagram. One of the Body Shop's biggest campaigns is their Forever Against Animal Testing campaign. 80% of all countries don't have laws on animal testing and the Body Shop is aiming to change that by launching their global two year long Forever Against Animal Testing campaign. They launched this in July last year and will run up until 2019. The countries highlighted in pink are those countries where animal testing is banned today. The Body Shop aim to change this and have more pink by the end of their campaign. They have teamed up with Game of Thrones star Maisie Williams to spread the word throughout social media. Facts and statistics will also be posted live throughout the campaign on YouTube, Instagram and Facebook. A key attribute of entrepreneurial marketing is being innovation focused and that is what the Body Shop is as they make their initiative to ban animal testing globally by collecting signatures for their petition. The goal is to collect 8 million signatures to petition to the United Nations to ban animal testing in the cosmetics industry. 800,000 of these signatures are predicted to come from the US. They use the hashtag Forever Against Animal Testing to create awareness throughout social media platforms. This campaign aimed to help restore the rainforest through their customers buying from a specifically selected gift range. These gifts were wrapped in animal print inspired colours and prints and with every purchase the body shop aimed to protect the bio bridges that enables critically endangered animals like monkeys, tigers, elephants and orangutans to meet their match. We promise to restore a square foot of rainforest for each of the selected gifts between the start of November and Christmas Eve will be promoted through 14 films created by the retailer's retained creative agency, Mr President. The films each featured a jungle animal relaying their Christmas ordeals are headed up with a hero film that showcases the ethical message, key products. Quote from General Manager, International Brand of the Body Shop, Omar Jante. The advert showed a number of rainforest animals singing along to jungle bells, including leopards, jungle monkeys, pandas, bells. parrots, jungle giraffes, and zebras, and a whole selection more. Have these methods been successful for the Body Shop? Well, in the Forever Against Animal Testing campaign, the petition currently has 4,708,694 signatures. Therefore, the Body Shop is over halfway through their aim, with this over a year to go as this campaign was set up for two years. The success of the Christmas campaign led to protecting 75 million square metres of the rainforest. This led to the Body Shop announcing a £2 million Briar Bridges scheme to protect the endangered rainforest wildlife. By 2020, they aim to regenerate 10 corridors between wildlife hotspots to connect isolated and endangered animals and plant species and allow them to breed and thrive. From completing my research into the body shop, entrepreneurial marketing activities, I can recommend that they could use other forms of advertising to market their campaigns. An example would be in the radio, as a small minority of the target audience of females aged 20 and 55 do not use any form of social media. However, driving to and from work or dropping the kids off, they will listen to the radio throughout the car journey. Another recommendation for the Body Shop is to use a different method of advertising instead of campaigning. For example, the Body Shop's biggest competitor is Lush. They also promote against animal testing and hand make their products, some in store. Lush spends zero marketing on advertising, therefore the Body Shop could do a marketing activity in store which would make their customers talk about them and advertise through word of mouth.